Welcome to Tips and Tricks. Today I'm going to show you how to solve a problem with updating the iWorks applications. So pages, numbers, and Keynote. So you might find on your computer that when you try to open one of those applications, it tells you, hey, there's an upgrade available. And then when you go into the App Store and look for the application, uh, it says an update's available. You click on it, nothing happens. It just keeps spinning like this. So you see, I've had this wheel spinning here for like half an hour and it's just not finding the update and it's not, uh, not doing anything to, uh, to download it. And even if you go here into updates, then uh, it'll show you some things that have uh, been updated. Um, but if you go into incompatible app updates, then you can see, oh, it's got a bunch of apps that we want to update that are incompatible. Now there's a way to fix this. Now what happens if we go back here and see pages? So it sees an update's available, but it won't let us load it because it's incompatible. And if we look at the details down here, we say, uh, see, in this case, it's this particular version is compatible at this time of recording with Mac OS 10.14 or later. So Sierra, or sorry, Mojave or later. But this Mac that we're running this on is actually running High Sierra 10.13. So even though the button's available here, when you click on it, nothing happens. You just get a spinning wheel here. And what you need to do is quit the App Store and then go into your Applications folder. If we create a new Finder window here and in the sidebar, go to Applications and then Find Pages. So here's Pages here. And then just move that into the trash. Don't uh, empty the trash just yet. And so here you'll probably have to put in your administrator password. So that's the password of your computer. You set up this password when you, uh, when you first uh, turned on your computer and set it up. So if you don't know that password, that's a problem. You're gonna have to figure out that password. Uh, but if you do, just type it in and it'll allow you to move that application into the trash. So now it's in the trash. It doesn't appear in this applications folder. It'll still stay in your dock because these are just uh, pointers to the app. So here's pages. And the same process will work for numbers and keynote. Now we're gonna open up the App Store again. And if I was to click on update here, it still wouldn't uh, find a compatible update. But if I search for pages, we will find the pages page here. And then now the update button is changed to an install button. I'm just gonna click here so we can see the full page. So now there's an install button instead of an update button because the app is now in the trash. It doesn't see it in the applications folder. So I'm gonna click on install and it'll say that the current version is not actually compatible. It requires 10.14 or later, which we don't have. We have 10.13 on this computer. It says, but you can download uh, an older version, the last compatible version. So we'll click download. And that version is actually an upgrade from what I have on here. So it'll give you the best possible version that uh, is available at the time. So here, depending on your internet connection, it'll download uh, quickly or slowly. We've got a fairly fast connection here, so it's downloading fairly quickly. And as soon as the download is complete, it'll start the installation process. The installation is complete, and now we're able to open pages. So you actually don't want to click the open button here because it'll actually change to this update button uh, because there's yet another version that's more up to date than the one we just loaded. But this version should be compatible with the new versions of pages that are on iPhones and that type of thing. I upgraded the pages on my iPhone and I couldn't open any files on my computer after that that had been worked on on my iPhone. So I needed to update it. And even though I didn't get the latest version here, it was up to date enough that I could open those files. So don't click, click update here. You can quit the app store and open pages from the dock and you'll get the newly updated version. Here we go, welcome to pages. And we're ready to go. So I just wanna show you something that's a little bit uh, different here. 
Uh, I found sometimes when updating this way that you don't see pages in your applications folder. So if you go to new finder window and then go to applications, then if you don't see pages in here, in this case we do, we're lucky the, uh, it showed up here, sometimes it makes the file invisible. Now, for some reason, if you know you have it loaded on there, it, it can open from the dock, but you don't see it in your applications folder. One way to sort of uh, get it to pop up is to go to the icon in the dock and then right click on there and bring up the menu. Right click or option click, sometimes on your keyboard, and choose show in finder. And then if this was not appearing in this menu, then it would force it to appear. So this technique will work also for numbers, also for Keynote. So it's a way of upgrading your version of pages, numbers, or Keynote past the version that you have on your computer right now, even if you're not fully compatible with the new one. And when you open your new version, you might get a reminder that there's a free version of update available, uh, or sorry, a free pages update available. But in this case, it's telling us that we need to install um, Mojave Mac OS 10.14 or later to get that. But at least we know we have the latest version that's compatible for our operating system right now. And you get past that problem of the spinning wheel in the App Store when you try to update. I hope you found this helpful. And if you did, please hit the thumbs up. We regularly have new tips and tricks coming out. Um, and if you know anybody else who might benefit from this, share it, uh, share it on social media, share this video with your friends. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video.